Hi, it's Megan, how are you? If your back's kind of still a wee bit sore from huddling up today after all that warm weather and suddenly it's cold, it's time to think about opening up and twisting out your body for spring. I've got a yin yoga workshop coming up on the 7th of April, Friday 7th of April. Uh, yin yoga is a restorative style of yoga that uses long held passive poses to nourish the connective tissues in the body, promoting greater physical flexibility, organ health, and peace of mind. This workshop is going to explore the ways in which we can keep our energetic body active and resilient. And that will result in a feeling of more vibrant health and higher energy levels. At the same time, um, yin yoga doesn't in fact deplete the body of energy, unlike some more um, dynamic forms of yoga. So you'll find that you replenish and restore yourself. So why should you do yin yoga as opposed to any other type of yoga? How is it better than say restorative yoga or the hatha and vinyasa styles of yoga you've been trying? Well, conventional yoga wisdom holds that nothing prepares your body for hours of seated meditation as well as a regular yoga asana practice. For example, your hot yoga classes, your ashtanga classes, um, sun salutations. Um, but when I started on my body to explore more intensive meditation practice, I, I discovered that in fact, um, sweaty vinyasa classes and advanced poses like arm balances hadn't actually improved my mindset and my ability to meditate. And in fact, they didn't actually even make me more flexible. So it took, it's taken me the best part of 20 years to be able to do the splits, even after um, a very, very regular practice of yoga. So uh, this is where yin yoga comes in for me and for a lot of people. You think you're too stiff for yoga? Try yin yoga. If you're not getting flexible enough in your yoga practice, even though you're practicing regularly, try yin yoga. And maybe you're finding that you're practicing yoga, but still not feeling particularly zen. You're still stressed out. Try yin yoga. So this, uh, we'll be doing a sequence for spring, which will replenish the body, a uh, yin yoga sequence for about 90 minutes. And then we'll follow that with a uh, yoga nidra practice. And yoga nidra is known as yogi sleep. It's a relaxation practice that works directly on the energetic body, inducing a state of wakeful calm and deep rest. Yoga Nidra is one of the um, practices Pratyahara, which is where the awareness um, of the mind is internalized. Literally, Yoga Nidra means psychic sleep. 